Babies born with tails have appendages that lack bones and can reach lengths of up to 18 centimeters. Official records as of 2017 have indicated that there were 40 babies born with true tails. These tails are soft, finger-like protrusions that can be surgically removed. Although these cases are rare, they attract significant interest due to the belief that they are benign remnants of evolution and distant ancestral connections. However, this perspective is based on an outdated theory, and the true implications of babies born with tails may be more concerning. The origin of human tails was initially theorized by Charles Darwin as accidental remnants or leftovers from tailed ancestors. Scientists in the 1980s further categorized two types of tails, true or vestigial tails and pseudotails, which may include bones and are associated with birth defects. Both types may be linked to spinal dysrophism, a disturbance in embryonic growth caused by a combination of genetic and environmental factors. Babies born with tails often exhibit related neurological defects and may require surgery and neuroimaging to monitor their development. Despite the misconception that these tails are harmless genetic effects, evidence suggests they result from congenital issues. Further research is needed to understand the exact nature of these abnormalities and their embryonic origins.